So can you give us any update on progress within DRF2 and when that might happen? Can, can you provide assurances to independent supporters that that's not a pie in the sky figure and you do have a you know, plan for the well, problem? I have a mandate to have, uh, give people the choice. Now in 2017, you said autumn 2018 was the common sense time for another referendum. Within that window, uh, I guess, of the UK exiting the EU, uh, I think would be the common sense time. <laughs> In autumn 18, you said you'd set out your plans for an independence referendum in the not too distant future. The Scottish Government will next week publish the detailed democratic case to enable a referendum. <laughs> In autumn 2019, you said the referendum must happen next year. Um, in the second half of next September. year, we've got uh, around about that time, yes. Um, and we'll you know, obviously uh, say more about that. In autumn 2020, you said you wouldn't rule out a vote in 2021. The legislation, if a referendum is to be delivered within the first half of this parliament, which is my preference. And in 2021, you said you'd start pushing for a referendum in spring 2022. When is going to be the right time?